I got a man that's been living his dream for a long time. First with basketball with the L.A. Lakers. Now he's living his dream as a businessman, doing his thing in L.A. and all around the country. Magic Johnson's in the house. New <laughs> network called Aspire. What's up, Magic? What's How you up? doing? What's up? What's up, Michael? And who's that guy you got with you? Crazy <laughs> George Wilborn. Oh, my God. <laughs> you have so George and I go way back. What's up, man? You got it, buddy. How you doing? Everything good. Magic, you've been having too much fun on TV, man. You are ha- you're like a little kid <laughs> doing, the, doing the finals, man. Well, Michael, you know I love basketball, man, first of all. And then the way LeBron was able to play and uh, to lead his team to a championship and actually, you know, uh, basically just quiet a lot of the criticism because uh, he was dominant through the playoff. And then also to see a brother like Dwayne Wade step back and say, look, man, this is your team. Now go ahead and lead us to the championship. And then I think that uh, Oklahoma, you know, they got a lot of young f- young players who going to really grow from this and learn from yep. this experience. And Kevin Durant and Russell Westbrook and James Harden will be back. They're gonna. Oh yeah, they'll be back before it's over. Yeah. Everybody and I was did. glad to see. I was glad to see Jawan Howard at the 18 years, yes. 18 seasons yeah. get a ring, well, man. Well, because when you think about Jawan, everybody don't know that every team and every clubhouse or locker room they need a leader. Jawan Howard was that quiet leader, professional, mm-hmm. well-spoken, yeah. you know, and uh, you need somebody like him. I mean, my teams, we had the same type of guys, you know, that could come. Every team that wins championships have to have a guy like Jawan Howard, and I'm happy for him as well. And every team that wins have got to go through that pain. I remember when Chicago used to get That's beat right. up by yep. Detroit all they the sure time, did. and everybody right. went through those growing pains, and finally they grew from that and became a championship team. So Oklahoma, My, ooh, boy, they're going to be scary later. Michael, you're absolutely right. Dallas taught the Heat a, a valuable yep. lesson. They, they taught them how to win a championship. That's See, right. you have to learn how to win it before you can actually win it. So uh, Oklahoma, hey, you, you, you just learned a valuable lesson from the Miami Heat. Mm-hmm. So That's right. So it, 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 Every every team, the piss, the bad boy Pistons taught Michael Jordan. Sure uh, you know, so it, it 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 goes that way. But I tell you, the league is healthy, is strong because of all the young talent mm-hmm. that we have, and I think people are gonna be really happy about NBA basketball right now. And then on to the Olympics. This we got some great uh, young NBA players gonna represent us at the Olympics as well. Let me talk to you about business magic because I got to tell you, I'm I'm so impressed with you. I've always been impressed with you as a, as an athlete and a basketball. player play but I'm more impressed with you as a businessman now you got the television uh, network Aspire launching on Comcast how did that all come about and and what do you want to do with that network okay great question Michael what happened was uh, Comcast after uh, purchasing NBC um, they had to award minorities and uh, Reverend Sharpton and Mark Mario over there at the Urban League and the whole committee they they made them um have two channels for African Americans and then two for Latinos, and so over a hundred people went after these two channels. You know, Bill Cosby, on and on and on, and so I end up winning one of those channels, and so I'm really happy about launching Aspire because Michael, what we and George, what what I'm trying to do now is bring the family content to yes. to to TV, sure and when we when we all grew up, we watched. TV with our family, That's right. with our mm-hmm. mom, dad, everybody sat around and watched it together. And so I'm trying to get some good programming, good content where we can, uh, and smart content where we can laugh, we can Thank think. Thank you. And also, Michael, you, you know, you and George, that's your show. That's been your whole show. You teach us, you educate us, and it's funny and, and good all at the same time. So we, we want to make them laugh, cry, think, and uh, be smart. You know, and so that's what I'm bringing to TV. Also, oh, you bringing me and Mike to your to your boy, state. Hey, George, <laughs> boy, I tell hey, you, you know, George. I told Michael when I met him, I said, you know, I'll be checking you out late night when you had your show. You know, <laughs> yeah. so I remember. Come on now, and so. And that's what type of programming that I want. And then at the end of the day, we got so many great actors and who are not actresses working, not and working, writers man. and directors yep. who are African American who are out of work right now yep. because there's not enough channels on TV uh, to give us jobs. But now I'm gonna hire a lot of those people. And uh, if we got great program, if you got great program out there for us, don't hesitate, call us.
Now, that is that is what I want to hear right there. Ladies and gentlemen, Aspire is going to launch on Wednesday. Today, man, check it out, June 27th in New York City. Yep. And we'll keep you guys posted on Facebook and Twitter about the other cities that come on. And once again, congratulations for everything yeah. you do, Magic. I wish you so much more success. Well, I really appreciate You know, you and George, again, Trayvon Martin. I can go with every situation. You guys have really helped us and really educated us and really rallied us. And, uh, uh, and so we really appreciate what you do. If I could, one quick second, I'd like sure. to just thank the people who really helped us launch this, uh, uh, Chrysler Group, Nationwide Insurance, L'Oreal USA, the Coca-Cola Company, and Walmart, because without sponsor, as you know, Michael, we can't, can't, have, can't, we do, can't do it. So those yeah. people really helped us. When we don't have anything on air, they believed in us. Keep doing your thing, Magic. Congratulations yeah, for everything. You, Magic. All right, God bless both of you.